Yo. What's good? What's good? You see the operation we're running oh. right now? Yes, I did. I did. I did. I did. Fantastic, man. You heard the prices and everything. Everybody wants to be a fucking seller right now. Uh, I told I told Mari and everybody to like make sure that you remember not to just include anybody, you know. So no. what's up? Uh, well, How's everything? Everything is good. The only problem is, um, I wouldn't say it's a problem, but there's something I need to talk to you about. Hey. What's up, Smalls? It's going down. You gonna go on, KJ? So, it's it's about Dre. Um, did uh, Reggie speak to you last night? Or were you around? Okay, what? So, I wouldn't say there's an issue, but there can be an issue for the future. So, Dre, he voiced his uh, little opinion about he wants to get Eli, uh, another grower, from the manor, more involved. Kind of like become um, a person that Dre can rely on if Dre needs to take a day off or whatever, so we get our product. Insane. Okay. Insane. What do you mean insane? Fucking insane. That's insane. Yeah, well... It's not like, uh, will you have enough growers? What do you mean? He yeah, knows that. Yeah, he knows. He knows. Like, it's it's the worst possible time to come with this shit because the whole fucking system changed. We're not growing out anymore. We don't need growers. I activated Fred again, you know? Fred is back. He's doing his thing. And That's he's a company good, okay. man. The, the only that what realized me with this shit is like... Dre is a part of a gang. If his gang is telling him to fuck us over, he can fuck us over if he wants to. A... B is like, I don't want to deal with that in the future. C is like, I don't, I told this to Dre as well. I said, like, I don't see any beneficial for us to go more in bed with what the manor are doing than we're doing today. I know that you speak to him and he tells you stuff and we get information from you, what Eli figure out, or we figure out stuff and you give that to Eli. I, I, I know because I, I proved that it was okay in the beginning, you know? But then again, like, I think that this can bring a bigger issue. If the manor tells Dre that he needs to fuck us over, he needs to follow that. Why? Because the manor is a fucking gang. That is gang politic 101. It doesn't matter how good of a friend. Now, I, like, I will fucking hate that, you know, because that becomes Dre will not be a friend anymore. So it's kind of like a dilemma mm. how to work this out because he haven't done anything wrong to me. He has done us good for so long. But I feel like the time is to just, you know, go separate ways to keep the friendship. Or the only thing I can see the beneficial here is the company and the manner on a bigger scale become more friendly. So we can avoid anything. I mean, that's a possibility, but is there a need to do that right now? There's not. No. That is the only way I see for us to kind of like work closely with Eli because I don't see uh, us gaining anything when we activate the Reggie. Like, I, I trust me, I think Reggie is the man, the myth, the legend who is in front of everybody. He knows more shit than they know and he always know it before they know it. I, okay, I think the biggest thing that we need to do right now is... Yum. All the weed, all the money aside. Okay, obviously you, the three of us here... We got we we got a little bit of affection for Dre because he used to be seaside, right? Yeah. I think the biggest thing is just give him the the benefit of the doubt, man, and then just we we need to talk to him. And I feel like the best thing to do is just tell tell him, "Hey, bro, don't put yourself in a situation where you might have to go against us, or don't even give yourself the opportunity to be in a weird position when it comes to choosing between us or the manor, bro." I like because. There's no reason he has to be with the uh, with the company right now, right? No, right? No, he's kind of yeah, like a contractor, him, be, you know. Yeah, just be, be honest with him, bro. Just tell him like we don't want to like we don't want to put you in a weird predicament here. And let's let's be real. The problem with Dre, you know, you know what the problem with Dre is, right? What? Yeah, it's it's literally the smallest problem. Yeah, like, he'll, he'll be he, loyal to them and he'll listen to anything that they say to do and then he'll do it even if it fucks everyone over and it's, and no it's not no i don't actually i don't think dre would do that i don't think I he would do that but he has to do that if they tell him to do it yeah. come on that I is think, the gang politics 
I think it's more like if they told know, him to do that, I don't think he would want to. But no, I don't think so. I don't think he'd do it. I think the only thing that he would do though is like you know he say it out. I, that's why I think we don't we don't need to put him in a position like that, you know, because I'm not enemies with the man. Like I I like the no. people in the man. Like fucking Sparky Terry and them, you know. Like the other day, some of the company boys got robbed. I I went I went to them and I asked them to give some of their stuff back if it was possible, and they they were happily more than happy to help out, you know. Yeah. So I think the only thing right now that we gotta do is just talk to Dre, let him do what he wants to do, bro. But tell no. him like we we can't have him double dipping, you know. That's pretty much it. Yeah. So I I I would say this though. I allowed him and Eli to share information like before this whole operation changed. You know what I mean? But now it seems more crucial what we're doing. We're still sh like he was helping us, you know, with the with the heat element, you know, for like quicker drying, and we helped them with something. You know what I mean? It, it's been back and forward. I basically acknowledge it because I knew that. He will most likely anyway tell them because he's a part of them you know he's a part of the manor so it's better for me for him to be honest with me what he's sharing than me saying you cannot share anything and and what if you know what i mean bro i think bro what can we do man i think no so the, you said it out already right yeah the only thing i was thinking is like i like he 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 doesn't like dre is great you know what i mean he's been absolutely fantastic he he puts like probably around sixty thousand dollars. He invested in the house right now of his own money to make sure that we are ahead of everything. He buys what he needs to buy. He put it up. You know what I mean? Like, there's nothing to put the finger on. You know, it's only like he brought this up and it's kind of like made me think. And it's kind of like the mm. worst possible point when he brought it up because we are not in the need right now to for the pharmaceuticals to go into bringing Eli on. I don't see a reason for it because we have dre we have reggie we activated fred and we have dow dow jones who is a uh, ott's boy like we have four mm, people you okay. know what i mean i gotta be honest with you i, I think mean, like, reggie is able to do everything by himself but still we have four yeah but reggie will not be fully company though okay that's the problem no the only fully company right now that's why i activated fred because i want one who is a grower who is fully active in the company in case something shit happens you know okay All that's, right, that's fine fred is i think fred is loyal for the uh, fred is loyal he, he's been sitting there okay. doing like basically helping us when when uh when dre and them took a break and uh he's do you just know that, do you know that fred was in was in just us yeah i know i used to yeah. deal with fred and sell him fucking scorpions back in the day he was one of my, one of my pushers I don't know what we're gonna do here, boys. I think I think that's a fair thing, right? We tell we tell Dre, don't put yourself in a shit position where you might have to betray your old friends for your new friends. Not saying that you would, but you know, we all know the question comes up eventually, right? Yeah, no, I got it because I felt like after that talk, it was me, Reggie, Mike, and Dre had this conversation. Uh, okay. Mike, him and Mike talked for like the day before. Dre was bringing a joke to him, like, yeah. Um, me and uh, me and Eli kind of like Walter and Jesse, you know what I mean? And if Walter is not here, Jesse will no longer be here, kind of like a jokey, you know? But Mike doesn't know him that well, you know what I mean? So I, I, I know, like, I trust Dre 110%, but I know what if, you know what I mean? What if in the future? But uh, I, I know, think because we would, we, would, we would do the same thing. Yeah. If so I was just, in a gang and I was Dre doubling in, just... yeah. To show him the respect that he deserves. Oh, no, no. Just be like, you know, this is, what do you mean, no? No, no, no. I, I, I know. Sorry, sorry. Uh, okay. Yeah. I mean, then, then it's perfect, bro. I think, I think you know where to go with this, man. Like, I don't yeah. want to put him in an awkward position because no. it's hard for him, bro. He wakes up EU. Yum. Yeah. He, he, he might meet you at times mm -hmm. or not meet anybody from the company at all. It feels like you're not a part of anything. Yeah. And I and I completely fucking get it, bro. And I, that's why I said it was like the Smalls problem. It's like, yeah, there was a moment in time where Smalls was waking up to nobody, just fucking twirling in the goddamn uh, the not seaside house. Mm -hmm. you know? And it's not it's not easy. And now he's found, you know, a group of people where he, you know, more and more his time and everything. So he might be happier, man. I will talk with him tomorrow and see what he says and let him kind of like decide what he wants to do and then i will put i will i will lay down how i want my operation to work from now on 
and if he wants to kind of like take his bag and move and help out with Eli and the manor and focus on that I kind of like approve that I pay him what we owe him and we'll leave as friends if he wants to stay he stays under you know my ruling the way I wanted to operate end of story all right that's fine I think I think that's fine but what are you laughing what does that mean what does that mean does that mean that he does not get to join the manor or what no it's that means that he's not time. sharing information Oh, that's a tough one, bro. Because that mm -hmm. doesn't matter. That's that, that doesn't that's matter. Like, you see, you 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 see where I'm coming from now. Then just tell him that. Tell him the truth then. All right. Say you think that it's better for for us as friends for him to back out of the company. Yeah. I think that's the, that's the biggest respect we can show him, right? Yeah. Because no, no. You're right. You're right. We we will fuck everything up. One one small problem in the future ruins that friendship forever, bro. Yeah. You know. And I don't want that to happen because. Uh, You've never done me you wrong. Should tell him, I, you, yeah. you should, yeah, you should tell it to him like this. Like, give him a fresh start, where he doesn't have no trust issues, nothing he got to deal with, nobody doubting him and shit like that yeah. from both sides, right? Yeah. And not that anybody is, but I'm just saying in general, we know how this all goes. And then, eventually, if there's ever a point in time where we got to work with the manor, he yeah. can be our guy straight away. Him and Terry, right? Yum, yeah. yum, yeah. yum, yeah. yum. Yeah. And it's fucking perfect, bro. Like, I got no, no problem with him at all. No, you know, me it's neither. Just, it's me neither. Be good timing.